So guys, I am back with another cyberpunk video and today I'm going to showcase to you guys an amazing way to earn tons and tons of money after the latest 1.6 patch. How's it going guys? My name is DPG and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the latest patch is now here. A lot of the old money making methods have been patched out of the game, but don't worry, I have another one for you which is super super effective it will see you turning 50 to 100 eddies to over 2000 every single time it is so so easy so so quick and it even gets cheaper than that at a certain point literally like 30 eddies to 2200 plus also what i mean to mention as well guys is obviously <laughs> to craft these things you need to have your your crafting specs uh leveled into so to craft rares you need true craftsman if you want to do epics goose monkey and if you want to do legendaries it's edge runner artisan simple as that now these will just discount other things make things reducing cost you don't need any of these perks i've got selected but hey simple Okay, so make sure you have them if you can. If you can't, like I said, if you're just starting the game, you want to make money, this is going to be your best bet. It's going to be rares. You're going to only be able to make a profit on crafting rares and selling them. Okay, so what we need to do, guys, is firstly, you need to be able to craft. So I'm going to show you the best case scenario. I'm going to craft a legendary item. We can do this with uh, epics. You can do this with rares. It doesn't matter. We're going to craft said items and sell said items for a big, big profit. Now, the best item I have to craft, which is going to earn me the most money, is the G58DN. I get 2,255 per sale of this thing. Now, if you don't have this blueprint yet and you can craft legendaries, uh, check out this quick little clip on screen now where this is. Go get this thing, guys. Okay, so once you have this, like I said, I'm going to demonstrate to you guys best case scenario. But like I said, you can do this with any blueprint. So if you have a blueprint for the Overwatch or whatever, if you have a blueprint to a rare, whatever, if you ain't at the stage where you can create uh, or craft epics or legendaries, then rare is going to be your only option in earning money. But like I said, you'll still turn around a decent amount of money, guys. So yes, look up a guide on YouTube for blueprints to the rares um, or the epics it's as simple as that guys once you have that blueprint come back to this video you're going to make a big big profit so you may as well okay so as you can see here the g58dn for me costs 14 rare item components 14 epic item components and uh four legendary components that is at a discount as you can see because my crafting is leveled up it's normally 25 25 and 7. either way so what we need to do guys is buy these rare components, these uh, epic components and these legendary item components. If you don't have any, you need to buy some. Now, where you buy them from is junk shops. Now, junk shops are all over the city. But I'm going to use this one right here because it's right next to a drop point, which we want to go to. So, as you can see right here, this junk shop is great. Because there's a drop point, it's right next to it. So, yep, come to this one. It makes things a lot easier. You don't have to. You can go to any junk shop. But, hey, come to this one. That's what I'm going to anyway. So, for me, come over and speak to her. There we go. Skip ahead, skip ahead. Okay, so, you can see she's selling uh, the items I need. One, two, and three. So, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to buy all of these because I've got the money to do so. If you haven't got the money to do so, don't worry. Buy as many as you can, but make sure you buy a good portion of each. So, I'm just going to buy them all because I can. i got the money to. Boom. Bada boom. 
and bada bum bum bum. There we go. Simple. I've got the items that I need. Again, if you're crafting a legendary or if you're crafting a rare, make sure you buy what you can of said material you need. Okay, so now we want to get to the drop point. Now you can use that at a shop. You can sell to the woman at the shop, but I like go to a drop point because it's nice and quiet. And there, so we're going to go to this drop point right over here. Because what we're going to do, guys, is, and this is a little sneak, we're going to actually duplicate said items we've just brought. We're going to duplicate them. So, come to here. And what we're going to do, guys, and this is how it works. It's quite easy. So, the items I've just brought, I've just brought these. So, the legendary item components, I've got 109 of these. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sell 108 of these and keep one for myself. I'm going to keep one in my inventory and sell 108 to this drop point. Boom. There we go. So, I've got one. There's 108 here. Now, this is the glitch part. So what we're going to do guys is we're going to go to the very end and we're going to go down two. So we're going to leave two inside of the drop point. So whatever number you've got there, always leave two inside of the drop point. And here guys on Xbox, what you want to do is you want to press X and A at the same time. On PlayStation, that's Square and X at the same time, as you can see on the screen now. So to do this glitch, like I said, on Xbox, x and a at the same time on playstation it's square and x at the same time and what happens is this you can see you press it you get the items there in your inventory but then guys they appear back here so you can just buy the full set again simple as that there you go they've duped simple guys simple and they've duped for literally no cost whatsoever there's no money involved here whatsoever it's a couple of hundred at least for all of them and you don't even need to do all of them at the same time you can build up your money before you start duping them in high number or high quantities so now guys we're going to go down to the epics what we just did where are they right there so again we're going to put them all in but one so we're going to put 150 but keep one for ourselves so there we go we've got one and then there is 149 inside of here so I'll click on this go to the very end and keep two inside the drop point and again, guys, make sure as well you aim on the bar here because you can mess things up and just do the same thing. If it don't work, it can bug out like that. As you can see, it's bugged out. Buy them out, buy them back. It doesn't really matter. You ain't losing no money. You're probably best to actually come out and go back in, in between each dupe. Probably makes sense doing that. I should have said that at the start. So just come out the machine and come back in, in between each dupe. And then, guys, come back down. So again, we're going to sell all but one sell all but once so we're going to keep one for ourselves as you can see right there and then guys we're going to buy back all but two but remember we're going to press on xbox it's uh, x and a a playstation is square and x and then we're just going to go bam there we go pop the up you can see i've got them there 148 i'll put in or 147 i'll put in whatever and i'm just going to buy them all back simple there we go dupe them as well then guys we're gonna go down to the res where are they now they should be around here somewhere there they are so we're gonna come out okay so we're gonna come down to the rare item components i mean i got so much shit here man again we're gonna sell all but one boom there we go now click on them go to the very end uh come back to make sure there's two kept inside of the drop point and again xbox it's x and a playstation square and x pc users help each other down below i ain't got a clue i can't remember playing on play, uh, pc such a while back okay so then bam there we go double the power loop simple as that and you can do this as many times as you want i'm just doing a quick demonstration here you can dupe all day all night if you want to that's completely up to you okay so now guys i've got enough materials to duplicate i mean to craft a ton i mean I've, I've just lost there 636 probably a little bit more who cares okay so 636 that's literally the price of one of these of what i'm going to sell so i can craft as many as i want i mean i've got plenty of materials now because i've just been duping them and duping them and duping them and duping them i mean i could sit here all day like i said if you've got 30k if you've got 20k if you've got 10k even you can make a ton of money doing this a ton of money doing this you actually don't even need that much money but it just helps in regards to buying them uh the materials to actually craft so the more you have to dupe at the start the better okay so then we just sell 
boom. 2025. Or 2255 even. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm tired guys, I'm tired. And we could just burn out this drop point. Burn it out. Burn it out. Burn it out, guys. And then we can simply just skip time by 24 hours. It really is that simple. Skip time by 24 hours. This is so fiddly on an analog stick. There we go. There we go. Skip time. Come back to the drop point machine. Sell them again. You will earn a ton of money doing this. Again, sell. So, 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 and if you've got fast fingers, unlike me, you can do this super, super quickly. Again, guys, skip time. It's really that simple. It's really that simple. And you will earn thousands and thousands doing this. So yeah, there we have it, guys. That is how you earn big, big bucks in the world of cyberpunk. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.